so difficult to blow off this giant balloon. I feel so tired after that. It isn't always that fun though, and I think I don't have the strong set of lungs. Hey, Eunice, don't be so down. Come on, cheer up. Come with me to this side. Let me teach you a super duper easy way of inflating a balloon. And later on, we can play together. Oh, really? I would love to do that then. Come, let's go. See what I have here. A balloon and a plastic bottle. I don't understand. What are they for? Now, do as I say. Alright. I want to carefully fix the balloon over the bottle opening. And now, lift the balloon out. It's a piece of cake. to do in here? Good heavens, you start us! Oh, sorry about that. I'm demonstrating to Eunice a simple way of blowing out a balloon. Oh, I see. That sounds interesting. Here are two jars of vinegar with full coloring. I want two of you to pour some baking soda into them. The reaction between baking soda and vinegar is an acid-base reaction as vinegar is a dilute acid and baking soda is a basic compound. When they react, sodium acetate and carbonic acid are formed. Mm, Carbonic acid falls apart into carbon dioxide and water. The bubbles come from the carbon dioxide escaping the solution. Carbon dioxide is heavier than air and so it flows almost like water. The carbon dioxide produced has inflated the balloon just now. Oh, I see. Let's pour more baking soda in the vinegar. Whoa! 